We'll see whether that makes it to air. I genuinely don't know. I'm going to have to listen back to it later. It's real okay. dark humor. Yeah, yeah. It's real dark yeah, humor. Yeah, like rock bottom dark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, can't yeah. see yeah, anything yeah. in front of your face. Dark. You should, uh, you should start the episode with that accent. What accent? That's my normal speaking voice. <sighs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to more You Don't Know Jack. Uh, we're on episode 37. I feel like... I haven't quite killed your, like, faith in humanity yet, but... No, you're just gonna keep my, stabbing. My name for this one might. Just gonna keep stabbing. <laughs> my name for this one might upset you. As uh, if oh. as if the previous rounds was not bad enough. No, man, I think you might. I think you might have a problem. Go ahead. This one. I think you might get mad. Do it to me. This is episode 37, Edible, Edible Toilets. Uh-huh. Brought to you by Tim and Two Girls, One Cannibal. Words fail me. I know they do. For how dumb. I know they do. Hey, they're, te they're technically edible toilets. That is. <laughs> I hope you're happy with yourself. You my goal. Just, you get to deal so with my that goal. For the next Twelve minutes. So my goal. This whole series has to at least once, at least once, for you to just like stop the beginning of the episode and be like, change your name. Please change your name. <laughs> just, just lay down the law. No, no, not this time. Not this name. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's ever gonna happen. But oh nice try, God. though. I mean, I, I commend your efforts. You were getting closer. I love the little like app icon for edit bowl. Edible I know, toilet. I know. Like you gotta, you gotta open it up real quick to see where you can eat while you shit. <laughs> What's the it's expression? Just a Mars bar. What's the expression? Don't tip your don't 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 uh, don't, don't tip, tip your waitresses. No, do Try tip your waitresses. Jesus, no. Um, I'm here all week. Don't dip your pen in the company e ink. Yeah, don't don't shit where you eat. Don't shit where you eat. There you go. Yep. Which is why this is a bad app. Right. Uh, Papua New Guinea is in there? Hey! I think we got it. Yeah! Hey, a geography yeah, question we didn't fuck up. I think it's now Papua and New Guinea. Yeah. Yeah. It was one of those that kind of split up. Yeah. I feel like they did separate. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah. That's a part of geography that we are fucking up. But hey, at least we got the question right. No, it's all right. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Listen, totally, will, we know exactly what I'll we're talking about now. I'll take a win. I'll take a win. We are we are a nation of winners. We didn't pause the game and get a globe. Like no, no worries. <laughs> Please, you think I have a globe? Oh. I try to stay away from gambling and casinos. Oh, okay, good. That's not what I thought he was gonna say. What? That he found a dick girl? Yeah, 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 Fair yeah. He went to Taiwan recently. Dude, cookies did some traveling. Cookies into some shit, man. Listen, no judgment. Slots, blackjack, poker, or craps. Hmm. He slots. She pokes her. I blackjack. blackjack. Craps! Shit! Tim! Craps! Please tell me you picked oh, craps. Oh no! You didn't I pick didn't craps? see it. You didn't pick craps? I totally craps, Tim? didn't see it at God all. God damn it. Oh, you oh, picked no. craps. You bitch. <sighs> Whatever you shall craps. I do? <sighs> Wait, how is blackjack a verb? Now, craps is to blackjack someone? Trust me. Uh, you can you can hit someone with a black guy. Oh, I guess. I don't know. Yeah. The second question. Wow. Nice. It's a gingerbread toilet. This way you can't tell the turd from the gingerbread. That's so sweet. That's yeah. so nice. Same color. It even that's, smells slightly delightful. That's the perfect thing to get a fetophiliac for Christmas. I know. A ginger poo. Yeah. I want somebody to Google that now. I hope no, you know that. No. 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 Just because you're a scat man doesn't hey. mean that you get to be all crappy to the audience. <laughs> I'm trying to set you up for some puns, Tim. I'm sure you are. I'm trying to give you some. Thank some, you. Some, I appreciate some clean that. humor. <laughs> Past or current member oh, of the fuck. band Guns N' Roses. What? If it's an yeah. ice skating jump, I now wish that I had seen Yuri on Ice. My mom is a uh, my mom's a figure skating coach. Oh motherfucker! Yeah. So are you telling me you had tights as a kid? Did you? Please tell me she taught you. Yeah. In a pretty little yeah. tutu. Yeah. Awesome. I had to do figure skating to do hockey. I'll bet you. Wait. Uh, well, yeah. No, that makes. I mean, that makes sense. 
Damn it. Wally. Dizzy. Slash. You're gonna get all of these. I have a bad feeling about this. Hey. Yep. Seven out of motherfucking seven. I also happen to like music. I gotta give it up to you. That's, I also happen to that's like good music. work. That yeah. is damn fine yeah. work. But dude, those are all like Lutz and Axel are all like a Wally one level. Yeah, jump. They're 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 not hard at all. Like the Axel is where you do a spin when you jump. You, you jump, you spin, um, and then a Lutz is what where you lift your legs. No, a Lutz is actually staying on the ice, but it's the multiple like rotations. Oh, okay, gotcha. Um, I think. From what I can remember, I don't remember. What I think a Wally is like when your legs go up above your head and you do like an aerial. Oh, okay. Thing. Huh. Could be wrong. It's been a couple of years. You, it's been a couple of years. Fast enough that you can just skate around the wall of the rink, like the Flash. Um. Hmm. I do love me some tacos. Choco Tacos. Those are quite good. I haven't eaten one in years. I know. It's been so they used to, Okay, long. they used to have, like, crispy shells, but now they have, like, spongy shells. Yeah. 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 And that depends on how long they've been around. Well, that takes it from a taco to a sandwich. Mm -hmm. When it's spongy? It does. It does. Yeah, it's, it's, it's it's not, that's an it ice cream sandwich. Yep. It, they're better when they're made fresh. Yeah. I would, there, there has been no place that I've found that makes a Choco Taco fresh, but that would be yeah. a pretty good business, I would Ooh, think. Ooh, fuck, dude. That'd be great. Yep. Cold stone could do like it pretty you, easily. Yeah, if you just like bend, cold stone bend a waffle cone. Amy's ice creams or something like that. Yeah, oh, yeah. Chinese food arrived. Pacos, Chaco Tacos. Yeah, you could you're open welcome. up a little like, my food truck, right? Oh, just skip the just give me lifetime access. Right. We should patent that before I'm saying. somebody makes like a Chaco Taco ice cream taco business. Yeah. I. All right, I'll talk to you after the episode. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Trademark applications are only $75 now. It's true, it's true. by its cover. Almost okay. as cheap as right. because if you did that, your you entrance fee. The Godfather <laughs> right. The, the two girls, Mary one cannibal Seals, show. Marionettes. Are we going to talk about Atlanta? Do you want to talk about Atlanta? Because we can talk about Atlanta. Uh, sure. Sure. Why not? Let's let's this talk about Godfather. the Atlanta story that you were telling me about. Oh, uh, shit. Uh, um, I think I remember this one, but I, I waited a minute. The Godfather. I do. The yes. Cover has a hand yes. A yes. Yeah. Right. Be and then that was kind of translated into the poster. Did you ever? Okay, this is weird Godfather trivia. But did you know an X appears on every character that's gonna die, and they carried that Italian mafia type deal into the Sopranos? Hmm. Where every every Sopranos character that's gonna die gets an X on them. No, I didn't know that. Yeah, interesting. And they faked out their audience a few times because James Gandolfini had like crosses on him. Right. Right. And then in the very last episode, when they just cut it off and pissed everybody off, uh -huh. very very briefly, he like makes an X with his arms and then like unfolds them. It's pretty cool. Mm. It's pretty cool. Interesting. Film knowledge trivia. So, Atlanta. I've been using this oh, God. You informed me about this news story. ATL orgy, yeah. And and feel free to do some Googling on your own, because I'm not going to do right. it for you. Um, there was a story about a girl, and, and you can correct me with any details. Let me see if I got the story right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There was a girl who put out a Craigslist ad for an orgy. And she said that it's all above board. It, she's gone through all the registration. She's gone through all of everything. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I think it's. Oh, I didn't get it in time. It's A. It's A. Because the Wicked Witch is green and Barney the Dinosaur is purple and those are both blue based. Oh. And it, it would give you 50%. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. That makes anyway, so girl puts an orgy up. She's uh, all above board, says you paid entrance fee to this PayPal account. Right. And, and you get in and do your business and it's going to be a good time. It's for my birthday. It's going to be a good time. And it's about three months away from now, so here's plenty of time to kind of get everything set up. So the fated evening happens, and the place where it was set up, unfortunately, was not informed that this many people would be showing up to do an orgy, or right. in fact, that anyone was going to show up at all. The birthday girl in question never showed up either. So then the orgy was then moved to another restaurant? No. A uh, house, something like that. House, it was another like location. That. And and unfortunately, no birthday girl was there either. And business happened for about half an hour before they moved on again to an, an Airbnb-style... Uh, house. Like, big, bigger, bigger space. Yeah. Yeah. 
really, really long. Damn it. For real? Porky. I never read yeah, Por Williams Oh, Williams I never read Port Lord of Flies. Really? Yeah, oh, that was yeah, one yeah. of those uh, required reading books that I didn't There's There's a, there's a character. He's fat, and everybody hates him, and his, his name's Piggy. Anyway, ATL okay. Orgy. So this girl, birthday, Orgy, charges people to get in. All these people sign up. Uh, they have to move locations to this mansion. Um, Tim, what else do you remember? So from there... They did business. Uh, the ratio of men to women that showed up was about 25 to 1. Now, there's some there's some dispute over this because right now they're reporting that no women showed up. Uh huh. But there are, like, screenshots and videos up of, like, women being present. Gotcha. And so then some digging was done by news organizations that right. found out about this and did some interviews with the men who said that they had a decent enough time yeah. in those kind of odds as well. Well as you can have and the women who were there it turns out were actually paid to be there if there were in fact any there at all um ooh, and i think it's gonna be ooh, um hang on i think it's that no, but flag really? cap balls are the main and only components. Because the flag is 13. Billiard balls is like 7. Yeah. And the cat in the hat's 5. five stripes on the cat in the hat's hat. Oh, fewest to most. Yeah, God damn it, I did yeah, it backwards. Yeah, 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 motherfucker. God smoking, motherfucker. Anyway, um, so girls were paid to be there, it turns out. And, or if there were, in fact, any girls there at all. And so the person responsible for this ends up coming out and saying hi yeah, I did this um well has all has also disappeared so I don't understand how they got the information. okay so uh, uh, so here's the thing the girl that organized this whole orgy thing her social media hasn't been updated everybody was like oh she's been kidnapped because she didn't have sex with anybody blah 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 whatever but news people did some digging based on her name and found out she's actually a psychology and sexual health student at a university in Georgia so not only did this girl get college credit, but she made off with a shitload of money. And then on top of that, what would a drunken Play-Doh shout at an Earth, Wind, and Fire concert? I don't know. I'm gonna let this one run out. I think it might be time. I think it's metal. This answer is too funky. I think it's nope, time. Never mind. Why didn't you pick this? Or water. Yeah. God damn it. For real? I was like, that's gonna be way too obvious. But anyway, so the genius of this is that not only did the girl film all of the night's activities, and she's gonna get college credit, she made a shitload of money, but she's probably also gonna distribute the film because, like. Right, one detail I forgot that right. there was some. There, like, it was actually had releases that people had right, to sign. Right, there, there was, like, NDAs and legal releases and stuff that people had to sign that obviously she hid her, like, psychology bullshit in, but there's also a clause in it that. She's basically allowed to like produce and distribute any of the content that she wants. <laughs> so yeah. she's going to be able to make a contract with like Vivid Entertainment for a million and a half dollars for uh, w the porn parody of the Bilko experiment. Yes, pretty much, pretty much. Yeah, where you have to fuck your way down to the last one. So my favorite part about this story is that like we we don't necessarily get the most joy out of the story details itself. It's more the reactions of Twitter uh -huh. and like Facebook and all these dudes that got on Twitter and Facebook and were fucking talking about it. Like they were super excited and they're like, oh, I'm gonna go fuck, it's gonna be great. And then they get on and they're like, man, I got ripped off. And it's like, what happened, buddy? Did you show up at an empty house with a bunch of condoms and wine coolers and somebody told you to sit down and pay them $200? <laughs> because, like, the prices the prices were crazy because it was, like, $99 to get in if you were a single female. It was $175 if you showed up with, like, your significant other. Uh-huh. And then it was $175 if you showed up just as a dude. Jesus. Hey, she made so much fucking money off of Dude, that. I'm probably, so mad at how genius I'm so excited. Like, I'm so excited to see what happens with I'm this. I'm so mad that I was because staring it's... directly at the clue. Yeah. Didn't even read it. Really? No. No, oh, I was shit. thinking about what happened there. You'll get this one here. I'm sure minute. I will. You but... will. Like, it's it's not difficult. Yeah, it's a, it's a light up butt. The answer is his butt. Yeah. That, 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 yeah. that busty, that's this, busty that's... butt. Oh, fuck. Nice. I thought it said took us. It's okay. Oh, noise. Abdomen. I mean, sure, but that's a bug butt. Bug right. butts are named after. Village of the Damned Children. What the hell? Um, what was there? What was the Village of the Damned? That's a movie. Oh, uh, shit. Was it their fingers? It wasn't I their fingers. Know. That was E.T. Eyes. Ah. Eyes. Evil children with glowy eyes. Okay. I got Frodo's it. sword? Ah, oh, oh, they got you on that cock. one, bud. 
They got y'all. Double now. cock. They didn't even capitalize it or anything, those bitches. It, the answer would be blade. Yeah. Duh. Because it's what actually glows. Yeah, it's what's not the, the name part of the glows. sword? Yeah. You asshole. Fuck. Fuck. I've never. Well, you you get mad at this game sometimes. I know. But there's there's some that are like real tricky. Thought that said something else. Uh, triple X flashlight. Oh no! Yeah, yeah. Triple <laughs> X flashlight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The tongue, the tongue of the flashlight. That's what glows. Everybody yeah. knows that. No, God it's the it. bulb. It's the bulb for sure. Still looking for like lens or nothing. Buzz light ear. What? Oh, Falling. oh, oh! I remember With this. Style. I remember this. Do you? Did his head glow? No, his head didn't glow. I had a Buzz light ear and it did this. Did you? Yeah, his spacesuit glows. Oh, awesome! I like thought it was the, just his wings. No, no, no! no all the I little wings all earlier. the little like details on his suit, like all the green stuff, that uh -huh. glue like glows. Oh, cool! Yeah. That glue. Glue. Yep. Yeah. Damn. The past Where? tense of glows. Damn. I yeah. don't know, but you spanked me. I know. I know. I was concentrating. Hell. I was concentrating on being factual, and somehow that translated into me also being smart. Uh -huh. And then uh -huh, sure. I didn't have enough time to be funny because I wasted it all on my name. <laughs> Is there anything else you want to say about yourself? About how humble you are and gracious in victory. And, I, I and like to think I'm pretty ingenious for the two girls, one cannibal thing to go hand in hand with edible toilets. I just have to say. Uh, don't you hate going to how old? No, no, it's not fucking clever. It would be clever if it was two toilets, one cannibal. You asshole. Two girls eating each other is cannibal in that, yes, they're humans. But it's not a pun on, on the goddamn name it's about toilets because they're not toilets eating each other. They're women. There's three people, one of them uses them as a toilet, and he also happens to be the cannibal. It's very simple. Hey, kids. I think you're just mad that I ignored the puns. 